Okay, so I know it's kind of dark, but we're going on the, another walk. Um, so we booked our tickets to Tanzania, to Dar es Salaam, and it was um, one-way tickets. It was $2,400 for three tickets. Is me, my husband, and our two girls, and the baby's gonna sit on our lap. Dad. Well, one of them, at least. Yeah, one of them, the little bit, my one year old. That's Buki. Hello, everybody. Are you excited about going to Tanzania? Uh, yep. Still got like 50 more days. You have any concerns? Uh, they lose the luggage. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he looked up the airline. Pooh. I don't know if you can see my baby. So how long was it? <laughs> the flight's supposed to be... <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. I'm trying to get rid of this post nasal drip too before I go. Um, <laughs> flight's like 22 hours or something like that. We are going to have a layover in Amsterdam. Um, yeah. So I'm excited. I've been looking up. Um, houses to rent and hotels and stuff. So if you guys out there in YouTube land know any um, connections, let us know. Across the street, yeah. Across the street. I've been wanting to go to Africa for about maybe seven years. I had an opportunity to go with my church as a, a teenager, but I didn't go because I didn't want to go by myself. And um, also, you know, just thinking about it now, they were going on like a, a mission trip and stuff. And I don't know if I really feel okay. Um, I think, I don't know, that people shouldn't really try to force their religion on other people, and I respect other people's culture and uh, their native original beliefs. So I don't really know how I feel about that as an adult now, but as a teenager, um, like I said, I just didn't want to go by myself, so I missed that opportunity. Um, I have a, a good friend, and she is from um, Dakar, Senegal, and so she had invited us and stuff. Her parents still live there, but. She lives in Virginia with her husband. So my original um, country I wanted to go to was the car, Senegal. Um, but end up not going because I got pregnant and had the baby once we had the money to go and then we were supposed to go last year for the year of the return to Ghana and Senegal I want to go to 12 countries um, immediately within the next couple of years but I want to go to all 54 countries 
in Africa. Okay, see, that's a better view of Boogie and my little stinky butt. And, um... 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 Yeah, so, didn't get to go last year because I had Molly. And... So now I'm just like, I'm not going to let... No, stop. Yeah, leave puppy alone while she go potty. Anything else stop us from going? And um, I've been really interested in going to Gambia. Um, <clears throat> the last couple of months. Um, but their borders are closed. The only borders are, that are open right now is Tanzania, Rwanda, and Egypt. So there's this girl on um, YouTube, Traveling Sister, and she has got me really wanting to go to Tanzania. She's ex-military. My husband is ex-military. Navy, to be precise. And, um... I see that she's doing, living her life and doing a lot of positive things over there. And my heart and my spirit is just really calling me to go back to Africa. My husband did his DNA results in his, um, for African ancestry. And the kit costs like $300 but for his paternal lineage and he is Nigerian I did a ancestry DNA years ago and mine came back of uh, Nigeria, Ghana, Senegal um, and some other few other countries I forget um, and European. He's waiting yeah, me yeah, to say yeah. European. Yeah. But <clears throat> we know where that's from. So <laughs> he always sees me about that. But anyway, my um um what's it called, Bookie? Oh, my modern day tribe nope. from the maternal line. From my African ancestry results, sorry it's dark. Um, it's from Sierra Leone. And I think they are the, what's it called, Buki? My maternal lineage and from Sierra Leone. The, what, what's the people called? I forget. It's Northern Sierra Leone. Uh, <coughs> Timbe. Uh, Timbe. Tuko, Timmy. No, not Tuko. It's T E M E. Timmy? Yeah, Timmy. Yeah, it's like Timmy people. I'm sorry, I'm butchering the, the name. I haven't. The name. I'm butchering the name. I haven't been saying it for a while. The Timmy people, I think that's what it's called. What's wrong, Pooh? You want to say hi to the people? Say hi, people. People. And um, for me, I just have this strong urgency to go, and um, I'm looking for some peace in my spirit. And I'm excited. So, hopefully, uh, the borders will open up in the Gambia. And you want daddy? Okay, you have to hold daddy's hand then. Come on, buddy.
in um, Senegal and Nigeria and Ghana. <coughs> and all the other countries I, that I want to go to. So, yep, I'm excited about connecting with some people. Um, no, no, no. My goal is to, um, you hear my husband talking about don't stop. Hi, truck. I was looking at Hi, truck. that's the little one back there. Hi, truck. Um, come on, buddy. Sheba. Um, dog, funny, dog. funny dog. Sheba's funny, huh? I lost my train of thought. Uh, Oh, the thing I was concerned about Hi. with the visa was do I have to have a um, returning ticket if I'm trying to stay for an extended period of time? Um, and I haven't gotten, oh, buddy, stop eating stuff. My dog always trying to get a snack. She finds stuff on the ground. Um, yeah, so that was one of my questions. Yeah, big truck. Too many cars. Yeah. Matt, yeah, come on. Hold my hand. Haven't got an answer to that yet. But also, what I was saying is, my goal is to um, eventually, like, stay half the year in somewhere in Africa. I don't know which country will we put uh, roots down in, but um, that's my goal for my family. My husband is an investor in real estate. That's his passion, and I'm just encouraging him to, um, that he can do it there, whatever he wants to do in real estate as well as out here. We have a property in Virginia, but right now we're in California. Because he's in school. And I'm a stay at home mom. So, yeah. I have some ideas and some things that I would like to do too. So, I'm excited. Y'all, they still popping these fireworks. I'm so tired of these fireworks. Come on, booty. It's real dark. So, until the next video, people in YouTube land. Bye, booty. Poo. Say bye, Poo. Cheese. Bye-bye. Okay. <laughs>